Okay, we should be live, I think. Okay, we're live, guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, everybody on the internet land. It's <laughs> Alex Z. And uh, today we have a special guest, a special guest uh, who is uh, kind of underground. Marker has been underground for a few years, but we dug him up for you guys, and <laughs> we're going to dig into his brains as well to figure out a lot of secret strategies to rank YouTube videos on Google and YouTube primarily, literally within three days. But just like, you know, so many people out there, you know, they they show you, like, uh, rankings and stuff like that. We're actually going to do this live, okay? So this is what's different about us, guys. We're going to show you. This is going to be a live case study, and we're going to show you how we're going to rank this particular video, this hangout on uh, top of YouTube within three days. Uh, so I know it's a, <laughs> we're not bragging, we're just showing you what's working right now. So you can steal it and implement it in your business. Okay? I'm not sure what this works. Okay. Uh, so uh, right now I think we're going to have, uh, have still people coming in. Uh, Boris, do you, do you see many people? Are people still piling up? Yeah, they're still coming in. We can. Okay, cool. uh, not, um, since we are waiting for people to kind of pile in, can you guys tell us in the chat um, if you can hear us? Just write yes, I can hear you, or no, I can hear you, whatever the case may be. If it's coming clear, uh, just whatever whatever is happening on the other side, just so we know, because Google Hangouts are a little bit choppy every once in a while, so we just want to make sure everybody can hear us. No, I cannot see the comments, so um, can you see comments? I could. Uh, so basically, guys, what you want to do on a Google Hangout is on the left side, on the top box, there's an icon that's called Chat Blue. So you want to click that, and uh, then you'll be able to chat and see what other people are saying and all that good stuff. So that way we can know uh, what's going on. You can hear us. One second. So can people hear us? I presume they do. Okay. Let me see. I'm not getting any uh, any comments here. With uh, one second. Click that, and then you'll be able to chat and see what All right. Okay. So what we're gonna. I'm going to assume that people can hear us. I'd love for people to be able to communicate with us and tell us if everything is going well, if it's too low, if it's too high. Uh, if we can hear us or not. Uh, we definitely have people piling in right in a minute. Uh, so if you guys have a chance, definitely let us know uh, that you can hear us. Like I said, we can usually do webinars, right? If I do webinars, those who can follow me. No, that I do not know. Probably five of us will have this. And then what was it? It was definitely more easier, I suppose, to communicate. Uh, however, Google Hangouts are a light, a new light. light and, uh, they're all the rage, man. They're all the rage. <laughs> now, what's, what's cool about them is that, that, uh, that you can just uh, start them anytime without really doing a lot of work. and. Uh, you can share a screen, you can have up to 10 participants and all that cool stuff. But what's cool is SEO perspective, I think, most more importantly. You cannot really rank go to meeting webinar on the first page of Google uh, as opposed to YouTube video. So that's, that's what it's all about. It's, it's all about targeted traffic for your business, whatever you're promoting. I know we have a lot of teammates on this Hangout uh, from our Empower Network team, and that's awesome, but we're also not selling. It's not a pitching webinar. We're not promoting anything. We just want to provide pure value to you guys. Uh, you know, as a token of appreciation for being on our list, being loyal subscribers of myself, Alex, Z, or Boris, and uh, just show you what we've, we've been doing behind the scenes, you know, how we've been ranking stuff on Google and YouTube uh, fairly quickly, even for competitive keywords. So this is going to be a live case study. We're going to start today, and uh, today is what, Tuesday? So Wednesday, Thursday, until Friday, we should have results. But uh, if you're wondering what that opt-in page below the video is, that's basically 
for for you guys to see the second day to, uh, results to get access to that second day webinar hangout. So we're not gonna broadcast that publicly on Facebook or any social media. So that's like a VIP list. Uh, so if you if you were invited by myself, uh, you have the link below this video. And same goes for Boris. He has the uh, other page with the same same opt -in, uh, different opt-in page where you can opt in and get on the priority list to get access to that second day uh, webinar. So uh, I think with the, without further ado, let's save everybody's time. Let's uh, get to the you know nuts and bolts of this. Boris, I'll pass the mic to you and uh, let let's start. Cool. All right, I'm I'll mute myself. And again, just like Alex said, guys, it's important for you to know that this is the first of the three videos. Uh, that we're going to do a live training on in terms of um, how to rank yourself on YouTube, uh, first page of YouTube, uh, in a matter of three days. And in order to see the results and follow us through day two and day three, you need to be able to uh, subscribe under you know each of us. So Alex sent uh, an email to his list, and if you're watching by this uh, Hangout, by uh, coming through his uh, emails, then you'll see the opt-in box. And if you're watching uh, this uh, Hangout, I keep wanting to call it webinar, uh, through me, then obviously you'll see the subscribe button on the bottom of the page. Uh, and that would be uh, the way to opt in because the, no the only link that will be sent to you guys to watch day two and day three, in addition to many more awesome um, things that we'll be sharing, uh, is going to go to the people who opt in on that specific list, okay? Oh, okay, so um, let's get going. So basically, let's do this. I, what I want to do is tell you guys a little bit about the general theory and what this whole thing is all about in order to move forward and, and actually go into the specifics and the nuts and bolts. Uh, we really need to understand where we're coming from, where we are, and where we're going, and why this is working, and you know, what this whole thing is all about. So this tactics, these strategies um, are very, very new. They're very cutting edge. Um, I'm not sure how many people in the world know about them, but I can guarantee you that very few. So these uh, tactics and strategies come about from marketers like ourselves who basically constantly test and develop new strategies and ideas, and there's a network of underground marketers or uh, those who you may not know their names or you know their names or um, even heard of them, you know. But all they do is develop strategic. Uh, I'd love to be able to talk, but not today. Strategic uh, ways of basically ranking, uh, for example, YouTube pages and Google pages and whatever else, right? And the whole idea is obviously to move not only with time, but even a little bit of ahead of time. So to give you an idea what, what, what this whole thing is about, it's definitely about using social signals, okay? We obviously know we're in a world of social uh, media and social signals and stuff like that. However, let me give you an example. Let me go back a little bit and give you an example of what took place um, back when Google Plus came about, right? Because this is the same structure, this is the same idea, and it's always gonna be around. If you understand these concepts, you'll be able to apply them in different mediums, and you'll be able to dominate whatever it is that you're looking for, whatever the platform is, whether it's Google, YouTube, Facebook, whatnot, doesn't matter, right? So when Google, I'll give you the short synopsis. So when Google basically realized that they're losing ground, with social media because Facebook became a dominant giant, um, they decided to come up with Google Plus, right? So when they came out with Google Plus, they thought we have all these Gmail accounts, we have all these users, we'll be able to easily, you know, play the game of social media, just write a platform, develop a platform, and people will jump on and we'll, we'll, we'll take away a market share from Facebook. Well. Unfortunately, or fortunately, whatever the case may be, uh, it didn't happen that way. So, and Google was definitely losing on the battle, and they still are in that respect. So, what did they decide to do? They decided to give users different um, ways or perks for joining Google Plus uh, and creating Google Plus pages for businesses and all that stuff. And those perks included things like authorship pages, meaning when you connect your website in a certain way with a Google Plus account, if you're a member, and we can actually go 
uh, later on and look at some of the examples, uh, some of the websites have little pictures next to them, right? The, the owner of the website or the author of the articles, whatever the case may be, the pictures are next to the organic listings, right? So those were for the uh, as a, an award, if you will, for joining Google+. They also helped you up in rankings, okay? So for just for opening an account and setting it up in a certain way, because it's always about a certain sequence of things that needs to be uh, done or applied uh, in order to get results, just for joining them, uh, they would give you certain perks and allow you or your website to move up in rankings, right? And not only that, they'll give you a picture. So in the sea of organic text, uh, I'm not talking about paid ads or PPC. Uh, I'm talking about organic listings on Google. So in the sea of text, you would have a website with a picture of the owner or the author uh, of that website or a blog, and that would stand out. So they would give you those kind of perks um, in order for uh, you, in order to kind of lure you in to the Google Plus platform in order to compete with Facebook. So taking that idea, back in the day, uh, I'm not going to give you the whole story about how I, I basically, you know, I was really, really good at uh, driving offline or brick and mortar businesses into the ground. I think if I still try now, I'd probably succeed. Not as good as it used to be, but I'd probably be good at it again. Um, if I try, I guess, if I apply myself. Bottom line is, um, I kind of had to get into the world of SEO because I thought as an offline business, uh, I need to be on Google page one and stuff like that, which of course makes sense. But I also didn't realize what it takes to master, learn, or apply the SEO, how long it takes. I knew nothing about it. I was just a business owner, right? A brick and mortar business owner. So. A lot of things happened. Um, I'm just going to give you, like I said, a short synopsis. Um, and essentially, I started. I hired somebody to do the SEO, and then I realized that they. And I also started reading and, and and learning and studying myself whenever I had time, in order to understand what's going on. You always want to kind of watch what other people are doing, understanding what it is that they're doing. So basically, um, what I've done is. I started studying it, and um, I enjoyed it so much that I started to understand things that are not exactly, well, between the lines ideas, right? And what I realized when Google Plus came out is that we can actually, let's call it a shortcut. We can actually jump higher, faster in terms of Google uh, rankings uh, if we start playing the game that Google is offering us, right? So if you, there's a war between these two giants, Facebook and Google, um, and there's still a war because Facebook today uh, is now trying to take away parts of the search engine that Google offers. But anyway, that's a whole other story. So um, during the war, if you play your cards right and if you understand what's going on, you can always take an advantage of an opportunity, so to speak. And this wasn't a scheme, if you will, right? This wasn't um, um, the, uh, some kind of way to go around everything. This was basically an official way that Google offered you to generate leads because once you, what happens when you are on, on page one, right? That's the whole point, to be on page one and even better to be in the top three position. You obviously generate leads. You obviously have a lot of traffic coming in and this traffic is absolutely free because you're not paying for it. You're just standing in a place where there's a lot of people searching for the type of service or business or opportunity that you are offering. So essentially, what took place is uh, I've learned enough to understand that this would be a way to go, right? This would be a way to go through Google Plus uh, uh, tools and tactics. Uh, I've ended up on page one very quickly. So months and months and months of work ended up being something that took weeks, which is great. But what we're talking about today is something similar and yet different. It's not about Google plus and the authorship, all that's great, but that's not new, right? We all know that's not new or uh, we wouldn't be, you know, uh, screaming about it. What we're talking about today is, first of all, <clears throat> more social, a lot more social, and also a lot more dynamic. So what we're talking about today are Google Hangouts. That's the big secret. Now, you, some of you may have heard about this, some of you may have not. However, um, even if you have heard about it, what we're going to do on this three-day live training is literally walk you from what it is that you need to do 
in order to get from nowhere. And we're going to actually prove that to you because this video that you're watching right now, we're actually going to rank this actual video on YouTube page one, and we're going to do it within three days. So by the time this uh, training is over, not only are we going to show you over the shoulder, step by step, explain everything to you, we're also going to rank this video that we're all watching now live. Okay? So the same concepts, the reason why I went all the way back to the Google Plus story, because the same concepts apply here. Google is still fighting the social war. They're still trying to get a market share from this whole thing. And videos and YouTube is a social medium, right? Google itself, the search engine, is not a social medium. Google Plus is. YouTube is. And basically what Google did is they came out with Google Hangouts for the same purpose, to get a little bit of a market share for themselves. But that's all great and, and you know, may be interesting to some and may not be interesting to others. What's the bottom line? The bottom line is us users, us the community of internet marketers, or if you're doing offline marketing where you're a consultant for an offline business, what that means to all of us is basically we can generate immense amounts of leads for free, right? And the biggest issue that we all have, I know I went through this, is when I started in the online marketing arena, and I heard about this guy, and I heard about that guy, and this guy has, you know, 100,000 on his list, and this guy has 100 people on his list, but he's a magician, whatever the case may be, the way that he communicates with his list. Bottom line is list, 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 list. That's the way to, do, to, to, to go. Well, how do, I, how do I build the list, okay? There are people who have funds that they're willing to spend to generate a list, and then there's a lot of people who don't have those extra funds. They need to generate the list, they don't have extra money, but they need to do it, and they need to do it quickly, right? We're not here to spend the next 10 years to generate, you know, 100 leads. We're here to generate as many leads as we can for them to be highly targeted leads, not some nonsense that we're getting, uh, again, not knowing who that person is, where they came from, and why they're on our list in the first place, but highly targeted leads, and we're doing it in the absolutely new way, the new modern way, which is videos. And by, by the way, speaking of videos, in about 2014, which is just around the corner, uh, video is going to take over in terms of the content delivered to viewers or people who are searching for whatever it is that they're looking for on the internet, right? So YouTube is going to dominate in terms of the search engine. The video as a content is going to dominate, period. It's going to be more video and less text. So you want to be in this medium to begin with, and if you know how to use this medium to generate leads, and you do that by being on page one, do you need anything else? Okay. Um, so basically, this is what it's all about. And this training, if you will, is, how should I put it? Um, it's worth a heck of a lot, right? It's, it's, it's really, really um, not being used by pretty much anybody which means not only do you have a way to get to page one, you can also dominate and you can also do it quickly and you can also do it efficiently. And you don't have to be, if you are worried about being live on camera like we are right now, you don't even have to do that, right? You don't have to even do a video. And I'll go through many different strategies that you can use uh, this, uh, I guess, technique to generate all kinds of leads Offline and online, you will, by the time we're done, uh, you know, I hear all the time about aha moments, right, or, 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 or uh, bulbs going off, or ideas. Well, by the time we're done, three days from today, we'll cover so much of out-of-the-box marketing that I am sure you can have one or two aha moments. Okay? So, hey, hey, Boris, I'll, I'll throw this in. Like, yeah, yeah. you mentioned uh, the value, the price of this information. Right. Uh, I th I, I'll throw this in, and you might want to mute yourself because I'm getting feedback from people that there's a lot of echo. Just for a sec. Thanks. Uh, you know, when we launched uh, Empower Network, uh, I was heavily into SEO, you know, and I ranked, uh, I think, two or three sites, I think two videos, two YouTube videos on the first page of Google for Empower Network, the company name uh, that, I, that I'm involved with. And when we launched, you know, just just because of that, I was getting so many targeted leads. People were just signing up left and right. 
And I think my first week was over ten thousand dollars. I think I, I did twelve thousand dollars in you know first week when launched, just due to the fact that I was properly positioned on first page of Google uh, by using YouTube videos. So that's that's the value right there. And I don't know what you are promoting. Maybe promoting something that pays you even more than Empower Network. Personally, I don't know any affiliate programs that pays you more uh, because I I've been involved with so many different programs and so many. Um, you know, make money from home network marketing companies, and they pay you like five percent, ten percent, twenty percent, maybe forty percent commissions. So uh, that's my perspective on things. Uh, if you align, I mean, if you align with something that pays you enough, like hundred percent commissions, you can take this to the bank, all the way to the bank, like I did. So back to you, Boris. I'm gonna mute myself. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, there's no question, guys. Uh, since I guess uh, I don't want to go too much too far because I have a tendency to go out uh, out on the tangent because of the information that's in my head. Uh, but the, we all know, you know, in the short version is we all know what it what it is to be on the first page of Google, to be the first page of YouTube, and to be the first top three positions, right? And the idea is if you are there and if you position yourself correctly in a smart way, you can do things that are pretty amazing. I mean, I'm not going to name names because I am not sure that I'm uh, allowed to, right? But I, I personally know people who make anywhere between ten to $40,000 just by ranking their content on YouTube for free, of course. And they generate that kind of income. So you can also have people who generate, let's say, ten to forty thousand dollars and do paid traffic, which means that ten to forty thousand dollars is not ten to forty; it has to be minus whatever you pay for the paid traffic, which is fine. It's perfectly fine. I love paid traffic, but when it comes to a scenario where you may not have the funds, and even if you do have the funds, even if you do PPC and you know free SEO stuff, right? Why not? Uh, bottom line is it's extremely powerful. It's ridiculously uh, uh, amazing and generates uh, unbelievable leads because they're targeted and you control the whole thing. And we're only going to be sharing this with, like we mentioned, uh, exclusive, exclusively with our list and exclusively with the people who are going to be action takers who are going to subscribe to this list. And again, guys, unlike, I guess, so much out there, we are not here to, we're, you know, even if you ask me, literally ask me right now, can I buy something from you? I'll tell you no. There's no sales here today. There's nothing we're selling today. There's nothing we're, you know, you can't buy anything even if you beg, right? Nothing. So this is pure information, pure content, because we just want people to be able to have the position and knowledge enough to help themselves to get out of this daily grind, because sometimes people are stuck they want to, they just don't have enough information. And we decided, you know, Alex and I decided that we have a lot of information that we can share with people and help them to get out of this grind that people so passionately want to, right? And that's the whole idea behind this. There's literally nothing here except that information about how you can use this for your business, whatever that is, okay? So bottom line is this. Let's get into a little bit of theory, and then I'll walk you through some ideas. Today, what we're going to do is uh, I'll walk you through a, a map, so to speak. I'm going to talk about the different aspects that this platform system is composed of, and then I'm going to walk you through the general you know, surface uh, structure or the bird's eye view of this thing. And tomorrow, we're actually going to get into the nuts and bolts of how to set it up, up step by step by step, how to get everything done from scratch, literally like from, you know, if you want to open your YouTube account from that point, it doesn't matter. Um, and then the day after, we're actually on the third and final day, not only are we going to share results and show you all kinds of things, but we're also going to give you a PDF which has step by step YouTube optimization techniques that has, well, let's put it this way, most of the people don't know them. There's at least, if I recall correctly, and this is off the top of my head, there's about nine places where you can optimize your YouTube video for a keyword, right? I don't know if you knew that, but at some point, I didn't know that. When I learned that, I was a little bit surprised because nine places to, you, to optimize a YouTube video, do you think that's going to give you an edge over everybody else, right? All right, so 
That's what's going to happen on the third day. We're going to also give you the PDF in addition to many more interesting content that's coming uh, from us and uh, for those people who are going to be on this list, okay? So let's get started. The idea is Google Hangouts, not the regular Google Hangouts. The real secret, the sauce, is in the live Google Hangouts, okay? So what happens is a Google Hangout is used, a live Google Hangout module is used to generate content of some kind, like we're generating right now. We're talking about strategies and techniques that can get you listed on page one of YouTube uh, in under three days. Now, when I say under three days, um, there's a lot, a lot, a lot of times when this takes place within minutes, okay? Um, I specifically didn't want to write this in the headline or in email or whatever, but it's true. I've, obviously, we've tested this thing back and forth, you know, so many times that it's not even funny. We wouldn't be here if we didn't. So sometimes it actually takes minutes to be on page one on YouTube from scratch. New account, new video, and you're on page one in minutes, okay? So it really depends on competition. It really depends on how difficult it is to rank the keyword or the keywords um, and all that stuff. So again, the idea here is social, social uh, media, right, which is... Google live Google Hangouts is certainly that. So what ends up happening? Let's 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 think about this whole structure. Just like with any platform, whether it's Google, YouTube, or Facebook, every platform is obviously interested in, or a company, whatever you want to call it, is interested in making money. That's what they're there for. So when YouTube is basically here's here's what happens. When people watch YouTube video over and over and over. Obviously, YouTube notices that, and it sees that this generates interest with people. If it does generate interest with people, that means that YouTube, without going too deep into it, is basically um, making money because they are showing uh, different ads and all that stuff. So there, it, it becomes a little bit like a circle. So you help YouTube generate money, and they will help you rank. So it's like... You know, you help me, I help you. You help me, I help you. And you keep going higher and higher and higher. Well, the shortcut, if I, I, I don't really like this word, um, but for the lack uh, of a better explanation, uh, to make it a short explanation, if you will, um, the idea is this, right? If you, what's the traditional SEO? It took months of link building and backlinking and all that stuff and, you know, high PR. And, I mean, that's just a link wheels... There's just a ton of things you need to do to, in order to even attempt to rank on page one, right? Well, with live Google Hangouts, because it's a Google product, because it automatically links to YouTube, what ends up happening, if you guys know, I don't know if you do, and we'll talk about this stuff in detail, in order to generate a live Google Hangout on your account, you have to link it to your YouTube account. So you have to have a Google Plus account, you have to connect it to your YouTube account, and that's the only way to do a Google, live Google Hangout. So what happens when you do a live Google Hangout, after you're done, if you go back to your YouTube account, you will see a new video that's being rendered and automatically inside YouTube. It's like somebody uploaded that video, except YouTube does that automatically. So YouTube and Google is obviously the same company as we all know. Facebook is like public enemy number one for these two. So what do you think happens when YouTube or Google, call it whatever you want, generate their own content, a trusted content. Do you think there's a better backlink, lead, something, whatever you want to call it, that a Google will trust than its own, you know, backyard, so to speak, because YouTube and Google is the same company, right? So they are essentially trusting themselves, not only that, because it's a live stream, it's a so very strong social signal. And now it's also a video, which is a strong uh, signal to begin with. So it kind of stacks on top of each other. And all of a sudden, if you use this correctly, if you use it in a certain sequence and add a couple of um, additional techniques to it, because that alone is not enough, but if you add a couple of additional techniques to it, all of a sudden you skip months and sometimes years of uh, SEO work and you're there in days. Look, 
I'm not going to uh, give away some of the uh, beta testers that we've done because I don't want to... Um, we've done this before, right? We've shared our uh, publicly uh, all, the, all the videos. And then for some reason, and very, very unfortunately, there are people who happen to have a negative mindset, and all of a sudden this, these video, videos get flagged. And these are regular videos. These are business videos, right? They get flagged. They get taken off. So I don't want to hurt anybody's account. So I'm not going to share anybody's results publicly with you, but I'll do one better. What we'll do, as I mentioned already at least once, we'll rank this video that you're watching right now with you watching it in the next three days on page one. And I'm confident that we'll do it because we've done it so many times. Okay? And we'll not only do that, we'll also show you exactly how it's done. So again, the bird's eye view is this. We basically do a live Google Hangout. Now, there may be a heck of a lot of questions at this point. Do I, do I have to do a live video? Can I do a, a, a slide video? Can I do many other variations um, that uh, are possible? Um, and the short answer is yes, okay? The short answer is yes by starting a Google Hangout and then sharing your screen and then running that video off of your screen. However, keep in mind, obviously, the quality of that video is going to be a heck of a lot worse than even the webcam uh, like we're doing right now because you're sharing the screen and blah, blah, blah. However, that's not the point. The content that you generate is extremely important and it's going to help you actually convert the leads, right? However, ranking itself does not need content per se. You can have a black video with no noise of uh, 30 seconds ranked on page one of Google. That's how powerful this stuff is. I've done this. As a matter of fact, this was my first mistake. I told Alex about this some time ago. I said, I think I've stumbled up, you know, to something insane here because I made a mistake because I was trying to set up a live Google Hangout and I didn't do it correctly. So what ended up happening is I had like 40 seconds of complete pitch black, quiet, you know, and noise like Psh. And I started a new Google Hangout, and I did the thing, and, you know, we, we had all kinds of shenanigans happen, and uh, we had a lot of fun. And then I go back, and I look inside YouTube as, you know, for some keywords, and all of a sudden this black video with my name on it under my account is on page one. And I was blown away, and I was like, whoa, whoa wait a second. You know, and that's how it started. And I, then we did a lot of testing, and there's, there's just a ton of stuff that happened. But bottom line is... It's absolutely amazing. If you know what you're doing, you can rank your videos on page one of Google uh, on YouTube. Now, I keep saying Google, YouTube interchangeably. You know why? Because as I mentioned, it's the same company. And in many, 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 many cases, when you're on page one of YouTube, you're also going to show up on page one of Google for the same keywords. How awesome is that? And guess what? You're not showing up as a text link. You're not even showing up as a text link with a picture. You're showing up as a video, okay? Because you're showing up as a video, you take up more space. You're more noticeable. Even if you're not in the top three position, let's say you're in number four, you're still going to get a heck of a lot of clicks, and in some cases a heck of a lot more clicks than number two or number three organic listing because you are a video with, you know, with the screen and all that stuff. So it is extremely powerful. It is extremely uh quick compared to uh, the traditional SEO and essentially to give you a roundabout uh, idea when you don't know what you're doing you're kind of stumbling through it you're beginning I think in a matter of about three hours and this is taking it real slow because guys I do it in 20 minutes so in a matter of about three hours you're on page one of Google that's how insane it is do you remember in a matter of three months, or in a matter of six months, or in a matter of nine months, and paying each month for SEO service, or doing it yourself, which is mundane, backbreaking, boring, crappy work, right, of backlinks and all that nonsense. Well, this is cool. You get to hang out with your closest friends, you get to just chill, and <laughs> then you go out, you have, a, I don't know, a beer, and you come back, and you page one of Google, and the whole world gets to see what you want to share with them, right? I, you, know, you know what some people do? Let me just give you an idea. 
some people actually want to get target offline businesses. So let's say plumbing. I'm just going to, whatever, it's irrelevant. Let's say you want to target plumbers or dentists or whatever, right? I'm not going to go into the online marketing just yet. We're going to jump into it in a second. But just to give you an idea. So what some people do is they rank themselves on page one on, let's say, New York plumber or best New York plumber, whatever the case may be, and they put a 30-second video on there saying, uh, assuming that a plumber is looking for his competition or even where his own page is, they basically put up a video and say, hey, are you looking for your own website? Well, as you can see, I'm here number one for this keyword, and I'd be able to put you here very quickly because obviously I know what I'm doing. Get in touch with me. Here's my phone number. Here's my email, and I'll make sure you are here instead of me. And they do this for every city in every state. And do you think they have more business that they can do know what to do with? You betcha. So that's just one light bulb for you guys to uh, to ponder on. Now with online marketing, right? People look for stuff nonstop because it's online, right? So making money online, or uh, I mean, there's just in, so many ways you can search for things, right? You can search for different niches. You can search for uh, how to make money online. You can search for how to uh, how to videos alone. I mean, any topic that you can name, you can actually start building an army of your own content in different searches. And guess what's going to happen very, very quickly? And this is just an uh, overall uh, rundown because the serious ninja techniques of what you can do with that stuff are coming tomorrow and after tomorrow. But uh, basically, all of a sudden, you're all over the internet, and you did not spend months and even years to do that. You spent a couple of minutes here and there. In your case, in the beginning at least, maybe an hour or two. And then you're, I mean, how does that compare to what it used to be, right? And in addition to that, just like I said initially, not a lot of people know about it. So. Let me do this. Let me uh, share a screen with you real quick and jump into the internet and hold on a second and basically show you some of the things. On a second, some of the things that we'll be going through. All right. And so, Alex, can you see my screen? Yeah. Okay. So let me go to Google. Right, let me log out. And essentially, guys, this is what we'll need to do. We'll need to do several things. One is to create a Google Hangout. It looks like we lost Boris because right, I think right. YouTube is watching that I want the secrets to be revealed. Boris, you back? I am back. I'm going to try to screen share again and hopefully this will work this time. 
and screen share. Oh boy. All right. Can you see me? Can you see my screen? Yeah, you're good to go. All right, cool. You're good to go. All right. So let's go into some of these social bookmarks um, that <clears throat> I'm going to share with you guys right now in order to understand um, basically, hold on one second, in order to understand what we need to do. So you probably know all of them. That's the funny part. And like I said, the all the biggest, I guess, uh, secret of any recipe is the secrets, right? If I give you a recipe to a salad or soup or, or some kind of, a, uh, I don't know, meal, <laughs> you can put things in a certain way to get a certain result. However, if you put them in a different sequence, you'll definitely get <laughs> a less edible result, right? Same thing with everything, including this. So there's a certain way to put things in a certain sequence, and you will get certain results. Don't, if you don't know the sequence, it's like the password or the code, it's like calling your friend, right? There's 10 numbers that, that are corresponding, uh, that, that phone number corresponds to your friend. You misdial one number, you're obviously not calling your friend, you're calling your future lover probably, or whatever the case may be. The bottom line is, uh, there's a sequence to doing things. So, these are some of the social bookmarks that we'll be using in order to rank our Google video that we're watching now. One is WordPress. All right, so WordPress.com, I'm pretty sure everybody's heard of WordPress. Um, you want to create a WordPress uh, blog, and as you've just seen, I hope you've seen, get a free blog here. All right, I'm going to say this a lot because that's the cool part. All of this stuff is free, everything. So let's talk about a very, qu very quickly about the ROI, return on investment. If your cost is zero and you generate leads that are extremely highly targeted for your business, whether it's an online business or an offline business, do you think you can make money if the cost of bringing in the people is absolutely zero? I hope your answer is yes, because if you can't generate uh, income with your having the cost of zero, you should probably look for a different business. But uh, I'm pretty sure everybody can think of a way or two to generate income when their cost of acquiring a client is zero. Okay? So, first plugin, I mean plugin, first um, social bookmark, WordPress. It ranks really well. It basically. Um, uh, allows, it communicates with Google really well, uh, and it does so very, very quickly. And as you can see, there's a post here. Um, I'll give you a sneak peek. There's a post here about this video uh, that we're doing right now, uh, sort of waiting uh, to be uh, ranked, if you will, okay? And I'm not going to go into details today, but like I said, I'm giving you guys the overall bird's eye view. The second uh, social bookmark is the very famous Tumblr. Guess what? It's free, just like WordPress. Sign up and blog away. Okay. Now you can create blogs up, to, you know, until cows come home. And again, it's free. Okay. And this is another very powerful social bookmark that you need to connect to your Google Hangout. The third social bookmark is Blogger. And guess what? That's a Google product. That means you are going to be using Google uh, Hangouts, YouTube videos, and Google blogging system. Stack, stack, stack. You think you're going to get good results in Google? I think the answer, you know the answer to that. So again, the third uh, basically a uh, system or the social bookmark is uh, Blogger, which is again a Google uh, uh, product or Google blogging system. Now, those of you who are inside Empower Network will know this. Those who are not inside Empower Network are going to see this, and if you know or don't know anything about um, SEO, then I'll give you again a very quick synopsis. This is Alexa. For those who know Alexa, know what I'm about to do. For those who don't know Alexa, Alexa is a, is a site that shows uh, which 
website ranks where? Because there's billions of websites in the world, and some actually care how high they are in the standing of the world. So Alexa actually ranks every single website there is. So if we actually look up Google.com, you'll see that Google.com is the number one website in the world and in the United States. It's the number one website. If we go to Facebook, you'll see that Facebook happens to be the number two website. And you see this thing, it dropped from number one. <laughs> so I'm telling you, Google is not exactly happy about their neighbor. Um, and YouTube is, oops, YouTube.com, number three. Okay, so you're playing with, um, I know I didn't mention Facebook before, but we will be using Facebook as well. So you're playing with number one, number two, and number three sites when you're putting together this system, and that's going to help you rank immensely. Now, let me. the reason why I came here in the first place is I wanted to show you what Empower Network blog is all about, because those who actually have the Empower Network blog have like a nail in the coffin kind of thing, because what happens is, in addition to everything you're seeing here, you're also basically getting something extremely powerful. So let me give you an idea. A very popular show, Daily Show, right? The Daily Show, Jon Stewart. I mean, I love that show. I absolutely crave watching it when I get a chance. DailyShow.com, I think. Okay, so The Daily Show ranks as the number 1,066 in the United States. Let's not look at the world for now because obviously it's a U.S. show. It's about U.S. politics and all that good stuff. So it's going to rank better in the United States. Now, this is a pretty awesome result because that's out of millions and millions and millions of sites, right? And again, The Daily Show being 1,066, just as an example. Okay, so let's look at Empower Network, for example, for EmpowerNetwork.com. Well, look at this. The Daily Show was 1,066, which is pretty damn good. Empower Network is 104th. Now, guys, the lower the number is, the closer it is to 1, obviously the stronger that is, because obviously Google being the strongest website in the world, excuse me, is number 1. Now imagine having a blog system in addition to Tumblr, in addition to WordPress, in addition to um, Blogger that ranks so highly in Alexa. And the reason why I keep bringing this up, even though you do have Google and YouTube and Facebook and all that stuff, if you have the Empower Network blog, you have an edge over those who do not. It's that simple. There's no fluff around it. It's very, very straightforward. You have another system that gives you an incredibly powerful tool, which those who already have it, you should be up, jumping up and down, because we'll be using this, in addition to everything that I just mentioned and many other things, to really rank yourself very quickly. So imagine being an Empower Network, and imagine that you need to write a blog about something. Well, guess what? What if you don't necessarily need to write a blog in a traditional sense. What if you do a combination of the blog and the Google Hangout video where it, it enables you to rank highly on all these systems, Google um, and, and YouTube, and you get a blog out of it and, uh, for yourself? I mean, it's a, does it get any more powerful? Basically, um, that's that's these are some these are some of the techniques that I wanted to give you a bird's eye view about, and having these tools they, uh, is is just going to help you become that much faster, that much stronger. Now, I personally use I'm an Empower, uh, and I use the blog very effectively to rank my um, you know hangouts where I want to. It's essentially ranking your video by will, where you want to, when you want to, and how you want to. And by the way, this is not a fly-by-night thing either. They're going to stick there for as long as you want them to, or unless the competition breaks you out of there. Well, the thing is, whoops, the thing with competition is that they don't have this knowledge. You're using the most powerful technique strategies that are available today, period. There's just simply nothing more stronger than what we're sharing with you today. Bottom line, 
that's the end of it. There's, you know, so if you're basically um, using these techniques, you will be getting leads. Let's let's put it this way: as many leads as you want, and from the whatever resources or 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 I should say avenues that you want, because you'll be targeting your um, uh, your leads essentially. If you go to uh, YouTube, just as an example, and write something. Now, this is obviously a bad example. Uh, all of a sudden, we are not going to YouTube. All right, let me try this. YouTube. Let's see. All right, and write something like, I don't know, I love Lucy. I have no idea. Um, you obviously see all these things, all these uh, videos that. Um, are about episodes about I Love Lucy. If you wanted to rank here, right, you'd be able to use these techniques and you'll be able to rank for whatever reason, right? So now look at this. 37 and, uh, and change thousand views. 145 and change thousand views. 187 and change thousand views. 155 and change thousand views. Let's go at any, I know I Love Lucy doesn't relate to anybody, but I'm just trying to make a point in a conceptual way versus, you know, anything specific for any business. Obviously, this applies to any business, any keyword, whatever. Um, so, uh, okay. You see these guys? Not only are these people liking, viewing this video, subscribing to this channel, they're commenting, 165 comments, they're commenting their butts out do you think these are engaged individuals on this specific uh, subject? Do you think these are individuals that if they find the content interesting enough on you, on, you know, whatever's on your YouTube video, that they'll opt in and look and listen and wait for your next piece of content to come out? Do you think these are targeted leads? If I happen to want to get leads from the I Love Lucy uh, episode, you, do, do, do you see this? Are the are, are light bulbs going? Uh, off <laughs> around your heads, you can literally target your leads, whatever it is that you're searching for, you know, the best New York uh, plumber, right? So this guy is probably a plumber because he put up a video and stuff like that. What if you could beat him and then, he, assuming you want to do offline businesses, and then you can email him and say, hey, I know you've been there for quite a while, but uh, I'm there now, and if you want me to... Uh, Help you. I mean, obviously, the number one position isn't the best. You can go to the page two and tell them, you know, uh, the famous saying that pay, uh, people, uh, pages go to page two to die. Well, I can get you there instead of my position on page one, and you'll be there in no time, right? And then you'll have a testimonial from a business owner saying that how amazing this is. Now, if you apply this to your online market, like, for example, Empower Network, what do you think is going to happen? What's going to happen is Empower Network happens to be the platform that allows you to generate 100% commissions, right? And the 100% commissions at zero cost in order to bring the uh, people into the system is pretty darn amazing, right? It doesn't get any better than that. I mean, you're not, there's no cost to you bringing in uh, these leads. There's no cost to you bringing in these people. And there's no cost to you basically helping other people who are just like you, who are trying to get out of this insanity, this grind, and they're basically having, they have a chance to do what you do. So one of the most common questions, and I'm going to take a little sip here, I'm going to pass it on to Alex after this, but one of the most common questions, uh, you know, is, well, what do I talk about? I mean, how do I do this? Well, guys, look, we're here sharing this exclusive, amazing content with you. If you've learned anything, and I hope that I was uh, you know, sharing this information in such a way that at least you've learned a little bit uh, so far that you can actually talk about this. This is your video content right there. Guys, I'm about to embark, or I have already embarked, this, is good, this could be your first video, on this amazing training about how to rank videos on page one of YouTube, right? This is just, you know, this stuff is absolutely mind-blowing, and I will be telling you or sharing with you these ideas. Look, I know that we're sharing this with our exclusive list, and I would hope that you guys are going to keep it to yourselves, because the idea is to be as exclusive 
as possible. There's a reason why you guys are on Alex's list. There's a reason why you're on my list because the information that we produce, the information that we share, and we do this with the information that we actually use with our subscribers is this type of information. This is what you get when you basically subscribe to either Alex or myself, and this is what you get in order to help yourselves to get to whatever level that you want to. Now, if before SEO seemed like something like, oh my God, I have to learn all these things and techniques and I have to sit there for six months typing away article after article, well, guess what? That's not a problem anymore. If money was a problem before generating leads, that's not a problem anymore. Building a list today using these techniques couldn't be easier. You'd have to literally, pardon my French, be a complete moron uh, not to be able to build a list using these techniques, right? I mean, honestly, there's like literally nothing you need to do except generate a video, follow a special sequence, and you'll be on page one, and people will be actually getting in touch with you saying, wow, you know, what is it that you're doing? I want to do that too. So you're not chasing them anymore. They're coming to you, and you're positioning yourself as an authority because, guys, if it's on the Internet, it must be true, right? Then if you're on page one on the Internet, well, there's no question it's true. And if you're on top three positions, then you're God, right? So bottom line is um, I will ask you one thing. Right, because this is extremely powerful information. Now, if this was a live training, I would literally ask you to sign a form because this stuff is powerful. But because I can't, I'm going to trust you because you guys are on our list, on Alex's and my list. So you guys are you know, people who we would want to hang out with, uh, even though we don't know you personally, at least not all of you. Some of you we certainly do. Um, I would ask you to do one thing. Please do not use this for, for the lack of a better word, in evil ways, okay? This is powerful stuff. You want to use this to help yourselves and to help others. Don't use it to, you know, bring pain to somebody in, in many ways that you can using these techniques. That's not why this is here. Everything can be used for good or bad. This is extremely powerful. And those who understand it are most likely, you know, when I realized this thing when I kind of when it came to me I was absolutely uh, floored because I do this this is what I do me and a lot of underground mastermind uh, that I network with is this is what we do we get together and we don't only get together online we literally get together um, you know live as well and we mastermind and we come up with all kinds of ideas and we test them and by the way if you have any idea what that means let me paint you a small short picture. In order to test any strategy, it takes money and it takes time because in order to test anything, you need to put your time and a lot of times you need to invest some money, at least initially, in order to generate some results, in order to go through these, you know, sort them, make sure this works, this doesn't work, and if nothing else, then the time itself is valuable. My time is extremely valuable. I don't just throw around, you know, uh, basically my time to for this and that. So basically, Something like this is extremely powerful and valuable because it gives you, it saves you time, it gives you authority, and it gives you a way to collect leads with zero cost. If you can't use this to generate business, whether it's online or off, like I said before, you shouldn't be in business. You should be working for somebody from nine to five because this is idiot proof. And I'm sorry for being blunt, but that's the way I am. This is very simple, very straightforward, and it doesn't cost anything. Right? Most of these techniques that we'll be sharing are free, and those that are not cost approximately $50 a year. Do you think you can afford something like that? And if you can't, stop eating those pizzas. You'll find those $50. Okay? Cook yourself a meal once in a while. You'll generate the $50 a year to use the tools that will save you a heck of a lot of time. And by the way, these are not my tools. I'm not selling you anything. These are third-party tools that I use to help me generate these results. Um, in addition to what I've shown with you. So I need to take a, a sip here. So I'm going to pass it over to you, Alex, and um, I'll, be, I'll be here, but uh, I just need to take a sip of water. Wow, Boris. <clears throat> I think people are just blown away. <laughs> I don't have access to the comments, but uh, this, stuff this stuff is, is too, too powerful. Too powerful to share, and uh, like I said, mm -hmm. like you said, board. 
don't share this with a lot of, a lot of people because it's, uh, it's uh, exclusive, exclusive information, information and uh, this, this is just a start, guys. I mean, what you're going to get access to over the next couple of days is going to blow your mind as well. And you we'll realize that you can do this easily without spending tons and tons of money on SEO, without, you know, doing a lot of tedious work that SEO usually requires. Because I was doing SEO before. I was doing tons of SEO before. I was doing SEO a lot. And I used to pay like $300, $400 to outsource it to an SEO person just to run my campaigns, to run those backlinks and, you know, create content. Content. With YouTube, you don't have to do that. It's a lot easier. It's a lot easier to get there and stay there. Okay, because I think I seen the comment or question from someone asking like, how long, how long will you stay in that position? Number one position, number number two, or number three position. Well, obviously it depends on the competition. It depends on how fit the marketplace is. But what? You have to realize have once to realize you have so much over the competitors, it's a lot easier for you to stay there as opposed to, to them try to knock you out from those positions. So hopefully that answers the question because uh, it's a lot easier to maintain position once you gain that position as opposed to trying to outrank people that are already there. Agreed 100%. Um, by the way, guys, I, I don't mind taking a couple of minutes, and if we have any questions out there, I don't mind answering those questions. Um, so, Alex, if you see any questions, you know, you can definitely pass them. And I'll be happy to take any questions in regards to this. Uh, uh, basically, the idea here is, hold on, let me just make sure that you guys can hear me. Can you hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Okay. Good. So the idea, the question is, how long can you stay there? This is not a fly, I already mentioned this, this is not a fly-by-night uh, strategy. This is not something that you're there for a day and then you're gone. This is exactly as strong and exactly as powerful as the traditional SEO. As a matter of fact, it's exactly, it, it is SEO. You're not doing anything that you weren't doing before. The only thing is that, because of the, con remember I told you in the beginning, if you understand the between the lines, you read between the lines of what takes place, of how this stuff works, of what takes place when two giants battle each other for, you know, the market share, then you are able to use that information towards your advantage, but not in a schemey way, in a way that is offered by the market and the way that is offered by those platforms. This is real SEO. This is social SEO. Traditional SEO is going to slowly die out because, guys, bottom line is what does everybody want to do? They want to link the reality, real life, and the online life. That's why we have all these reviews. That's why we have all these backlinks. What is a backlink? It's equivalent to a referral from a human being, meaning if I tell you this sushi place, and I love sushi, so this sushi place is great and we're friends, you're probably going to listen to me and probably take a chance on this sushi place because I recommended it to you, okay? That's what a backlink is online. When Google basically looks where those backlinks are coming from to your site, if it's an authority site, they will listen to that site and say, well, if you're recommending it, it must be worth some weight. So that site now has a little bit higher uh, PR or stronger weight in the, you know, in the list of all the sites in the world, which is when we looked at the Alexa, those numbers essentially show you the summaries of where, you know, each site is in the world, right? So this is a way to use the today's world, which is social. Everything is social now a lot more than anything else, and this is a way to use social uh, backlinks instead of the traditional backlinks uh, in order to... Um, rank yourself higher, whether it's in YouTube or in Google. Now, because of the systems that we're using that are inherently um, born and brought to us by Google, that's why we have such power. We're leveraging the massive giants. We're leveraging their system. We're not doing anything illegal. We're not doing anything that we, you know, that we shouldn't be doing in terms of what SEO is all about. What we're doing is we're doing it in a different way. It's like, uh, I don't know, I guess it's like cooking, right? It's, uh, you, you can cook 
something faster or slower, you can go cook something better or worse, whatever the case may be. Um, nothing comes to mind right now. I'm giving you stupid examples. But I, I, I mean, essentially, bottom line is this is not a skinny way. When you get to page one, you stay on page one, let's say rank one. The only way for you to fall from there is if competition becomes stronger than you are. Because remember, SEO is not about you. SEO is about you in relationship to everybody else and vice versa, everybody else in relationship to you. So just because you're there and you, let's say you've stopped optimizing this, um, this uh, search for, for yourself, you basically, and, and your competition keeps doing it, they will gain ground. However, because you have such a massive advantage to begin with, it is easier for you to stay there if you keep, let's say, you know, uh, having one or two backlinks a month or something, uh, which again, these backlinks can be in the way of another video. You do another video and in the description, um, you post a link to your original video. Now, I'm getting a little ahead of myself and there's a ton of strategies, but the bottom line is, this is not something that, oh my God, I'm there for 15 minutes and then I'm gone. No, this is as real and as solid as everything else out there, and you will be there for pretty much as, <laughs> until either you close that video, delete that video, or until somebody gets enough ground that it will move you to you know, uh, uh, place two uh, as opposed to, let's say, place one, right? Now, we all know what, it, what place, what, what number one, number two, and number three positions are on Google, how powerful they are and how much traffic they can generate. So there's no need to go into that. However, the bird's eye view that I wanted to share with you, um, I pretty much have today, guys. Basically, what we're using is the Google live Google Hangout, social bookmarks, and then we're going to be optimizing the YouTube video itself. Excuse me. Those three techniques, and these are again bird's eye view. Each of them has, uh, you know, its own little tree inside. So there's little things that you need to do in certain sequences for each of these steps to generate these results. However, the results are nothing more than mind-blowing, okay? When you do this for yourself for the first time, you're going to be absolutely blown away that you've gone and got yourself to page one. So another common question, I suppose, is something like, well, what do I talk about? Look, guys, this is going to go as far as imagination can take you. You can have interviews of each other. You can talk about, by the way, Something that I guess may be a common question, maybe not. Sometimes a should, ask, should ask question is more important than a frequently asked question. Um, so a should ask question is, can I do this by myself? Absolutely. You can start a live Google Hangout with zero audience and still rank it on page one of YouTube and, and, and Google and so on and so forth. I've done it, okay? Now, I'm not going to tell you that having an audience uh, you know, having an audience does help, but I've gotten my videos by coming out and speaking out there as if I'm speaking to a lot of people. Do you know why? Because once this baby is on page one, guess what's going to happen? Thousands and thousands and thousands of people are actually going to listen to you and replay. So when you speak, even if you are, there's nobody there now, imagine all the thousands of people that will listen to you once you do get there, right? So, again, it all comes down to one thing. Why is this whole thing in, here in the first place? Why did we, you know, sit there and mastermind and, and come up with these ideas and, you know, we have a heck of a lot more strategies in every platform, whether it's Facebook, whether it's YouTube, whether it's Google, whether it's Pinterest, whether it's uh, podcasting, whether it's digital magazines, whether it's SMS. I'm not kidding, guys. We are using all these systems and we're using them in unbelievable uh, ninja ways to generate ridiculous amounts of traffic, extremely targeted. Most of it is free, unless we're using a paid strategy, which again, when we do, we do. But this stuff, for example, and many other things, are obviously free leads. So even with long tail keywords, right? Forget making money, which is like a, not a long tail keyword. It's a very two words. It's a very high, a highly competitive word. So let's forget that for a second. Let's say you do, you do long tail keyword, making money online, living in New York, right? Something like that. What if you have hundreds of those? Did you know that if you have a lot of long tail SEO keywords that are fairly related, the main keyword, like making money, as opposed to making money online in New York, you are actually going to show up with time 
on making money because you have so many long tail keyword videos that rank so high. And there's a way to do this, except the battle on the pages of long tail keywords with these techniques are absolutely like David and Goliath. You'll dominate in no time. So you'll dominate, let's say, a hundred different uh, long tail keywords. And honestly, this is maybe not, you know, uh, for all of you, maybe not all of you will understand this, but over 50, over 60% of all purchases are done by people when they search in the long tail keyword fashion. Think about it. Even catch yourself next time you're looking for something. Do you write something like, when you want to buy a car, do you write something like blue car? Or do you write something like Nissan Pathfinder 26X blah, blah, blah? Do you write something 3.6 liter engine as opposed to whatever else? I'm not a car guy. I'm just, yeah, so it's hard for me to make these analogies. But bottom line is, think about it. What do you do? You write, when you're ready to buy, you're literally ready to buy, even if you go to eBay, if you ever shop on eBay or Amazon, what are you going to write? If I want to buy this phone on Amazon, I write Samsung Galaxy SC8, whatever the freaking model number is, right? That's very specific. Why? Because I'm ready to buy a very specific product. That's how we all think and act. So being on a page of Samsung is useless because I'm not going to Samsung when I'm ready to buy. I only go to Samsung inside the Amazon platform when I'm just kicking the tires and window shopping and all that stuff. So having a hundred, and I'm don't you don't have to have a hundred. I'm just using this number just for the heck of it. So having a hundred long tail keywords out there for your particular product or service is going to give you extremely highly targeted, ready to buy people, ready to listen to you, sign up to your list, and say, okay, where do I click the button to buy whatever product or service that you're offering? Okay, that's what happens. And if you know anything about all the big names like Jeff Walker and Frank Hearn and uh, Ryan Dice and Jonathan Bott, do you know what they've done when they started? They found some kind of a niche or an idea, and they multiply this niche or an idea that brings them, let's say, $100 a day, 100 200 500 times. Same thing as we're discussing right now. Do you know these names because they're not successful? No. You know these names because they're overly successful. If that, that's even such a, if there is such a thing. My point is they, 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 they are really successful in what it is that they're doing. And when they started, they started by doing these techniques. I know because they're my mentors. So basically, this is not a new idea that you take long tail keywords and you have you know many, many uh, uh, keywords over there uh, on YouTube and Google and you dominate and you build your list and stuff like that. The only thing that it takes is you wanting it to, to, to be done because right now, as far as I see, there's absolutely nothing that stops you from getting to where you want in terms of anything because it starts with a list and then it goes from there. While you've just heard and you will know the exact steps of how to generate a list for free. Once you have a list, you start generating obviously relationships and income with that list. And it's a lot easier to do that if your list is highly targeted, if your list is built of people who you were going after as opposed to just random people uh, who are not sure what they want, why they want, and so forth and so forth. So that's essentially it, guys. I mean, I really uh, value your time. I know your time is very valuable. I also know it's, you know, uh, at least in New York, it's almost 10 o'clock. I, uh, you know, I could talk about this, honestly, for years. I love this stuff. I live for this stuff. This is what I do. I could talk about it for days. But I value your time. I certainly value my time as well. So I don't want to take too much of it. We'll di dive into the details of all these techniques tomorrow. And today, I just want to finish up before I pass it back to Alex, saying that, first of all, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much for your attention. I see that we have a massive number of viewers still here, uh, as we did from the beginning. So I am hoping that means you guys got some content uh, out of this, something helpful, something interesting. I hope it serves you and helps you. 
and opens up some ideas, some doors for you. Yeah, remember tomorrow's training and after tomorrow's training, where we're going to go step by step, is only going to be available to those people who sign up to the uh, uh, buttons or the forms on Alex's and my pages that were sent to you. Okay, you are not going to get an email or an invitation or anything unless you sign up to those lists. And those are VIP lists that we'll be communicating to and sharing the special techniques of how to do this. Okay, and there's a lot more to come in terms of content information that you will be blown away by. So that's pretty much it. Thank you very much for your attention. Thank you very much for your time. And uh, that's it. Alex, take it away. Wow, Boris. Um, you might need to mute your microphone because. Yeah, yeah thanks. Uh, Wow, that's amazing. That's just amazing. I can't believe you you, get, you spilled out so much content, bro. It's like this kind of stuff, like I used to pay courses that, that haven't really covered maybe 20% of what you just uh, spilled out in the last uh, 90 minutes or so. Uh, I certainly paid over $500 for one course and $1,000 for another course just to gain this understanding, you know, basic stuff of SEO and how to outrank, you know, your competition. And the uh, long tail and all those concepts, it's, 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 a, no, it's a known uh, stuff that a lot of people practice. But a lot of people don't. A lot of people don't know that. And it's really great that you brought that up because that's like virtually there's no competition. Just find your niche, uh, do research, and uh, dominate your marketplace. And that, that's how you generate tons of tons of tons of Later, target leads for your list, and then it's it's game over in your business. It's like I like to say, game over, because it's like it it, it's, it becomes so easy. It's like taking a uh, candy from a baby, you know. Even though I kind of find it find it funny that that phrase, like why would you want to take a candy from a baby? It's just evil. <laughs> but in any case, but that's basically what it is. You're taking candy from uh, from other marketers because they're uh, trying so hard to rank on Google and YouTube. By spending you know three hundred five hundred dollars every month on SEO campaigns, and here you are coming with the secret strategy uh, with Google Hangouts that literally nobody else knows about. So guys, opt into the list. Okay, don't miss out on the opportunity. On the next day, we're gonna uh, give you exact nuts and bolts, and we'll show you the progress of our campaign, how we're ranking this YouTube video on YouTube and Google. So uh, I want to thank you for being on this live hangout with us. Uh, you know, spending time away from family, but it shows us that you're serious, you're actually taking your business seriously, and you want to get to the next level. Uh, so with that, I want to wrap this up. Thank you so much, Boris, for spilling your guts, man. And uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. So be on the lookout for that email. Make sure you opt into your to my list or Boris's list below the video, and you'll get that special VIP uh, invitation tomorrow. So be on the lookout for those emails tomorrow. And with that, guys, take action. We'll see you guys tomorrow.